This year's Fund a Cause is for financial support of our teachers. While parents are the primary people responsible for educating their kids, the day-to-day -day in the trenches, that's the teachers. They're the glue that holds Holy Family together. I mean, they are spending nine hours a day with our kids and they are teaching them the foundations of our future. The faith element is really important to me. They start their day with prayer. They pray before meals. There's crucifixes in every room. They're surrounded by the sorts of people I want them to be surrounded by. These teachers put themselves out there. They care, lifting people and treating people with dignity and respect. The heart and the smart with which they operate, I just am truly amazed. We know that it is so important to find talent as well as keep talent at Holy Family. I think that in order to support our mission, it's just imperative that we support our faculty and staff. They choose to teach in our system, but they need to get paid for what they do. This is one way we can help with that. Pre-pandemic, our teachers worked very hard. They're always trying to make the program better. When the pandemic hit a year ago now, sort of, you know, on a dime, we turned and became an accredited deliver a virtual education. The original sentiment was this is very temporary. And then as it kept going, it was tense times. I was nervous. I felt school is very important, obviously, and we definitely needed to continue that the best we can. And the teachers are the type of people that are able to learn and change on a dime and be innovative. When things blew up, you got a call from a teacher talking to us and saying, hey, this is what we're going to do, this is how it's going to go. And their proactive outreach is like, wow. The teachers were amazing. They made sure my kids at home were engaged. They were constantly checking on them. When we were able to get on Zoom to see their faces, and you could just see Mrs. Burke's face light up when she was able to see all of her kids. It was just, it was really great. Everyone agreed that the number one thing we needed to do was to have kids in classrooms. Our parents wanted it, the students want it and need it. So we set up protocols and safety measures. Holy Family did so much work behind the scenes to have our kids be able to go to school. I mean, you look at what was happening around the country. That wasn't happening. Other school districts weren't able to pull it together like we were. My sister is a teacher in Houston, Texas. She said, these kids that were at home didn't thrive the way the kids that were in school. That's not an easy problem to solve. I have been so grateful as a working parent to have my kids at school all day, every day. We've all stayed healthy and the kids are just so much happier. The flexibility, the creativity, the dedication of the team to come forward with the plans as quickly as they did and to pull it off and doing it safely. I'm proud of the Holy Family Administration. I'm proud of the teachers. I'm proud of the staff. That flexibility that the teachers are showing, learning the technology, but also giving students the options to be in class, but also to stay online. We know families where people are sick at home and they cannot afford to bring home COVID. We have benefited from that when all three of our kids have had colds or you know various illnesses we've been able to seamlessly pivot from in-person to virtual learning honestly without missing a beat. The teachers made it feel like it wasn't a lot of effort when I think we all realize it was. As we're all learning they have learned a whole new way to teach, to reach out, to educate the resolution of issues as they arise, they've been amazing and just adapting. And that's the kind of staff Holy Family has. They've just been incredibly, impressively willing to work with the kids, to work with the parents. Most of us aren't tech people. I've watched all of us try to learn how to adapt to a Zoom meeting. And most adults have struggled. So then to do it with the first, second, third grader, I don't know how they did it. These teachers are like the person that provides the stability and perspective that we all needed during this time. Given the excellent job pre-pandemic and the heroic job post-pandemic, 
Now it's time for us who've benefited from that, parents, grandparents, supporters, to help us help our teachers in delivering that day-to-day -day education to our kids. The fund a cause, the fact that it's going to teacher salary, I think universally everyone agrees that we can back them more for their amazing work that they do with the most precious entity that we all have is our children. The teachers at Holy Family, I can't, I can't even begin to tell you how appreciative you and I are. They need to be taken care of because if we're going to expect the best of our students, we need to provide the best for the educators that are providing them the outstanding the leadership and guidance. When I see the way that the teachers engage with my children, it truly feels like family.